here we have two fractions, one quarter and five eighths, and we're going to add them together. The toast on the left hand side has four equal parts, and the toast on the right hand side has eight equal parts. Let's count. The fraction on the left, one quarter, has four equal parts. So the denominator is four. The numerator, the number on the top, is one. So that means one slice out of the four is going to be chosen. The fraction on the right, five eighths, has a numerator of five and a denominator of 8. The fraction on the right is 5 eighths, then the numerator is 5 and the denominator is 8. So that means we're going to choose 5 slices out of the 8. Let's see what, we, what happens when we try to add them together. The slice from the bread on the left and the slice from the bread on the right seem to be of different sizes. You can see how this little slice from the right just can't fit into it. It's just too small. We've got to fix this, and we're going to use the denominator number on the bottom to do this. You see how the one slice from the toast on the right just fits on top of the slice on, from the toast on the left, but it's about half the size. Watch as this eighth slice from the toast on the right fits in just in the other half. So we see two eighth slices fitting into one quarter slice. Notice that in the denominator, for the two fractions, the numbers are different. This is why we cannot add these two fractions yet. We've got to make the denominators equal. A synonym for equal is the same. The toast on the left should have eight equal parts instead of four equal parts as it is now. Let's divide those four slices into eight equal slices. Now, all of the denominators are the same, or equal. Let's look at the original question. One-fourth plus five-eighths. The original one-quarter is now... is now... 2 eighths. What about the other part of the calculation? And 5 eighths. That means we need 5 slices of the 8. 2 eighths plus 5 eighths. So we're going to show you what 2 eighths looks like for the toast on the left. Now that our denominators are the same, those two slices can now join the other slices. In the end, we can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 slices. Out of 8 possible spots, our sum of 2 eighths plus 5 eighths is 7 eighths. Because the denominators are different, we need to change them so that both denominators are the same. To do this, we need to find the lowest common multiple. The multi multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, and so on. The multiples of 8 are 8, 16, and 24. We need to find the lowest common multiple that is shared between the two of them. We can see that 8 is the lowest multiple that is shared between the two of them. 
Looking at the two fractions, we can see that one of the fractions, 5 over 8, already has a denominator of 8, while 1 quarter has a denominator of 4. So what can we all multiply 4 by to get to 8? The denominator does not change, whereas you add the numerators, so 2 plus 5 equals 7, and there you have it, 7 eighths.